Hi everyone, this is Cody with CRS Labs, and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Baldur's Gate. Last time we were here, we were exploring the town of Nashgal. We had it mostly explored. Um, I'm pretty sure our characters are in good health. Oh, we should probably sell some of this extra stuff we have before we get underway. It shall be as you wish. Let's see here. And we're going to be headed to the Nashgal Mines today. With the iron shortage um, that's right, I think I sold most of this stuff. Horn Whispers, that's eh, probably a good thing to hold on to. I'll sell this pearl and the splint mail. Anyone else have anything? We're gonna hold on to that just in case it breaks. Um, I am just going to be straight up uh, realistic about this. I am pretty sure uh, we're gonna take some heavy injuries and hopefully no one dies, crossing our fingers. Um, but we'll see how this goes. I'm actually, uh, I think, I think we'll do all right. My main concern is that we only have five in the party, um, and if we were to pick up any of the other characters, most of them have temporary missions that we'll probably want to trigger before we actually finish the mines. Um, not that I would take that long, but I don't want a chance anything bad happen. So we're gonna head to Nashgal Mines. You have been waylaid by enemies. Oh, of yourself. course, even on the way to the mines, we're being attacked. At least it's hobgoblins, so mostly incompetent creatures. Uh -huh. um, we need to get near out of the and line of fire. How may I do oh, this? Somebody's casting magic. Well, that's unfortunate. We'll have to. Uh, probably have to rest up or sleep in the caves, which is fine, as far as the, uh, as far as the enemies that will fight in the caves, at least at first it'll be mostly kobolds, and those are very manageable, well, comparatively to other things that we're going to encounter. Um, Take the rest of these arrows, gold, oh, we don't need the helmets. I know I'm leaving behind a bunch of uh, free loot, but we'll be getting plenty of it in the mines. So let's see here. <clears throat> now, if no more interruptions, we can make it to the mines, that'd be great. It shall be as you wish. I think there's also another hidden item here. Um, not 100%. Definitely stumbled on that one in the other in the other episode completely by accident. I had completely forgotten about it entirely. Um, there's actually one that I remember now that we should probably go back and get at some point. I thought there was one over here. Um, how do I get over there? Nero will find a way. Maybe it's up here. I think it's up there. I don't think it's down here. Hopefully, I'm not crazy. These hidden items, man, they make all the difference. Ah! I was right. Could have Jahiri get it, but why? The theory is it's just like, ah, I will take that. Oh, that looks like a lightning wand to me. Um, oh, a wand of frost. Okay, that's fine. We'll give that to... No, we're not close enough. Yes. We'll give that to Nira, though. Give her something a little more consistent to output the magic damage with. Let's see here. Oop, there we go. Oh, still too far away. Where am I? Oh, I'm all the way over there. If none are better. Oh, there he is, Emerson. Nature serve all the group. I'll have Jahira talk to him. So you want to take a look at me mine, do you? I really don't be needing adventuring fools wondering about me mines. Especially ones that think they can tromp about with nary a thought of asking them for permission. Hm. You've got one day. If I see you after that, I'll have a new shaft dug for each of you. Got that? Good. Well, I'm How may I be I guess it's about as pleasant. Trumpet. As I could expect in this situation. 
Oh yeah, New Year's definitely. We're gonna have high use that entire wand time? down here. Stand away, citizen. I wish you guys luck in there. Whatever's been causing all the trouble isn't something I'd want to run into. Well, that is why we are here. Um, yes. Okay, good. I have fine traps on. You have the very, ask. very, very first time I ever went through these mines, I had oh, no idea I'm how traps so worked, tired. and I died quite a lot. Miner Gourd. Hmm, more adventurers, eh? I'd leave why you still can if I were you. I've heard awful stories about what's happening to those that go deeper in the mines. Why? What have you heard? Well, my friend Rufy barely escaped with his life he did. Little demons jumped out of the very walls and chased him down. He'd be dead now if it wasn't for the guards that came running. Of course, them guards are dead now. Old Ruffy's around here somewhere. You ask him what he saw and he'll tell you. Did I call him Rufy? Rufy? Ruffy? Ruffy? I think it's Ruffy. Maybe not. Who knows? Get these guys and their naming characters. It is much work to be done. What do you want? What do these demons look like? What do they look like? They look like demons, you blasted idiot! Wow. Incredibly helpful. Let's see what's in the minecart. Contaminated iron. Eh, no sense in taking that. It's probably not good for anything. If you know that contaminated ore is good for something, please leave a comment down below and we will absolutely gather up as much of that as we can. Explore each of these tunnels. I'm not entirely sure if there's anything special on the first oh, floor. Oh, I'm so tired. I'm here breaking my back to feed my family. What's your excuse? Looking for adventure? You'll find it below if you're fool enough. The dead walk beneath the earth. I mean, I don't blame these guys. Oh, I'm so tired. Miner Leslie. Lots of walls everywhere they are. No room to breathe. No room to breathe. They said they'd paid excellent wages, they did. Didn't say anything. The little holes, did they? No, space is too small, they are. Space is too small. Um, are you okay? What? Don't you see the walls? Walls everywhere. No room to breathe. No room to breathe. They said they paid excellent wages, they did. Didn't say anything about little holes, did they? No, space is too small, they are. Space is too small. Um, so clearly these guys are exhausted, <laughs> overworked. I think I'm coughing up blood. Minor Cory. What is it you want? Can't you see I'm a busy man? I've heard there are problems with the mines recently. I'm here to try to help. Hmm. I don't know what you can do about it. Sure, there have been problems. The door that we've been pulling out of this place is crumbling almost as soon as it's cast. What about the miners? They keep disappearing one by one. I'm missing four right now. In the last few weeks alone, we've buried at least five others. I guess I can't talk to him again. He just walks off. I don't think the soldier will say anything special, but we'll try. Stand away, citizen! You make one move that be suspicious, and I swear your head will leave the mines before your neck. So, even here on the first floor, I think I'm things are clearly blood. not good. A visitor. A glorious day. We don't get many down here, as you can imagine. Are you going to be down into the mines? If so, could you return this dagger to Kylie? He dropped it when he went into the mine the other day, and I haven't seen him since. Sure, I'll return his dagger. Thank you so much. I'm sure he'll appreciate it. Yeah. If, he, if you haven't seen him... And he doesn't have his dagger. Uh, I could wager what happened to him. Ah! Our first demon. Gorion would be proud of your actions. Thank you, Kalheed. I appreciate the appreciation. Let's see. Minor Dalek. So dark down here. What? Oh, it's just another fool here to save us. Go ahead. 
Try to rid the minds of their evil and get yourself killed like the last couple. Last couple what? Adventurers, you idiot. You think you're the first to try to save us all? Not likely. Not going to be the last, I'll wager, either. Man. Just doom and gloom. I mean, I guess this is the, the universe of Dungeons and Dragons, so... I mean... I guess if you get to wake up the next day without being stabbed in your bed, it's a, it's a great thing. <laughs> or, you know, having a phoenix source for <laughs> explode on your body. I think I'm coughing up blood. Minor Marvin. Uh, hello there. Is there something you want? So, what do you think has been happening with the mines? Didn't you know? The mines are haunted. The ghosts of all those that have died in the mines are here to kill us all. They said they'd spare me. Liked me, they did. You can see it in their beady little eyes. You, you saw something? Of course I saw something. Had a nice long conversation with the little chap. Would have asked him to stop haunting us too if the supervisor hadn't kicked me. Said I was sleeping on the job. Can you imagine? Um, yes? Minor Bob. Well, obviously this is the most important character. His name is Bob. Is much work to be done. Finally, someone has come to save us. Do you know something about what's been happening here? Sure, I know what's happening. What do you want to know? What about the missing miners? Oh, them. I told them before they went. Tried to, at least. Naturally, there must be a dragon down there killing them all. He must be mad about us mining his hill. Poor thing. Leave us be. Tis much work to be done. Uh, have you heard about any creatures in the mines. Just the dragon is all. Haven't actually seen him, but what else could be killing all those miners? Leave us be. Tis much work to be done. What about the ore? Oh, we don't ship as much out as we used to. We do pretty much... We do pretty well, considering the shortage of people we have to help, though. He's probably the most optimistic one we've met so far. Let's see, how are we doing exploring? Okay, so this level's almost done. Ah, another kobold. Oh, my heart's really not in this. Let's see if there's any more. Gorion would be proud of your actions. Should probably wait until I'm actually at the front of the pack so that we can detect any traps. Okay, if memory serves, as soon as we come around this bend, things start going crazy. What is it this time? So just to be safe, I'm gonna cover my bases. It shall be as you wish. Yep, called it. They're coming! The yipping demons, they're everywhere! Save me! Never fear, we shall protect you from any harm. But, but I... There they are! There are they! And there they are. How may I be of assistance? So, wait, why can't I? Oh, the helmet does obstruct it. What is it? Protects against critical hits. Um, I think Calheed is. Yeah, we'll give it to him instead. Not being able to cast magic is a problem. What is it this time? Oh, never mind. I'm womp womp. Everyone's probably like, moron, you only had the one spell, and I just totally, totally missed that. Totally meant for that to happen. <laughs> okay. What is it this time? Well, now that I'm not embarrassing myself. You rang? First, we're gonna get this uh, frost wand <laughs> off. You're a queer fellow. We'll have M O M attack him. Yes, O oh, omnipresent authority figure. Chihira, shush. You have need of me? Calhid, you're gonna go after this guy. Yes? And I'm just going to attack everything. Oh, my heart's really not in this. Oh yeah, criticals! I love criticals. How may I be of assistance? Wait. I to ask. Oh wow. I completely missed that they all died. Let's give them a wow. Or, uh, All right, yeah. Let's clear out these mines. You're telling me the soldiers of Om couldn't handle this? Oh, 
course they couldn't, they're from home. There's gonna be a little, a couple angry people in the comments down there like, what you, what are you, what are you saying there, guy? <laughs> you got something against Ahm? No. Maybe. Oh, I'm so tired. God, by the gods of all the depths, you scared the living bejesus out of me. Leave us to get back to work, will ya? Gotta meet our quota or they'll send us down to the lower levels. Last crew lost five men down there. Oh, I'm so tired. That's just one of the same responses we saw earlier. Maybe there is. I don't remember what traps are in this area. Hmm. I really, really shouldn't we just keep clicking ahead. I, mean, I say that, and yet I'm going to keep doing it. <laughs> I don't know how my main guy keeps getting caught up in the back row. I don't remember this part. At all. I don't know if I've ever been to this area. You have but to ask. Oh, there's Kylie. Oh my gosh, she is alive. So dark down here. You have my dagger? Thank you very much. I was getting nervous down here being unarmed. With all the things going on. What do you know about the happenings of the mine? Cobalts. They're overrunning the place piece by piece. We used to see them occasionally, but now you can't go more than a few feet without kicking one of them on the lower levels. It's not so bad up here with the guards around. Still, I wouldn't get caught in the dark if I were you. So, we got some XP. It's always nice. I don't think there's anything in this room. No. Maybe there's weapons. Which reminds me, I'm going to give Calheed that Warhammer, yes. just in case something happens to those other weapons he's got. Hopefully not. Hopefully everything is just hunky-dory. Oh, more Cobalts. Let's give them a right down to size. I guess the one advantage to running with the five party instead of six in here is we get a little bit more XP between all of us. Maybe with some luck. I'm not gonna look at where, who's the closest leveling up right now, but maybe with some luck, uh, we'll level up before we get to the bottom. I don't know how these soldiers don't see half these kobolds or hear them. Hmm. Anything down here? So we have most of the western part of the map explored. For level two. Let's see. Still nothing. Now, I feel like every time I see water in the caves is where there's a trap somewhere. Let's see if they spring Let's give them a right fresh. to the next level. Alright. Actually, I believe the first trap is just before we get to level 3. I don't mind fighting kobolds or gibberlings. These are they're really easy. Even hobgoblins. Gnolls aren't too bad as long as you're, there's not like an overwhelming amount of them. At least I don't think so. Yeah, this seems familiar. Uh, I don't think there is anything over there. Anything worth looking at anyway. My of course, I'm probably wrong. There's the probably side. a secret item over there somewhere. No. Oh, hang what? on. Uh, yes? Khalid, you were taking way too much damage for comfort. There we go. Oh, timing. Let's give them a right fresh. Oh, I do have the AI part down. I'll probably have to look at the AI settings uh, after this this episode and see if there's something that they're not doing. Yes. Oh. Well, definitely don't want our main character to die. That would be very bad. Hey, 
So we found the mysterious liquid. Let's put all these gems in the gem bag first. Oh, good. Can she identify it? No. He probably could. So. Pick up the other one. Yes. We have to you on our way. Okay. So it says this potion contains a strange green substance similar to the residue you have seen in some of the mining carts. The liquid appears to be very slightly discolor to very slightly discolor iron that it comes into contact with, and is likely related to the mysterious plague that renders smelted weapons and tools brittle. The cobalts you killed must have tainted all the or leaving the mine, though it is unlikely to have concocted the plan themselves. Drink potion. Let's not. Hmm. If it was reacting with iron, it could really be any type of acid. Cool. To the extent that it's reacting, I'm not thinking it's nitric acid, if there was such an equivalent here in this universe. Alright, level three. This is where the fun begins. Alright. I have to keep. Ah ha! I knew it. I knew there would be one. It shall be as you wish. Our first trap. Joseph's greenstone ring. Yes. So we're gonna have to be very, very cautious walking around this area. How may I be of assistance? The part what is that stinks you have is but that to ask. I have to leave my main character vulnerable. All right, we're gonna let them come to us. Just in case it's a trap or something. Oh, it's a hero. There we go. So the AI is working. Yeah, we can't afford to lose Kalheed. I can make sure he stays alive. Or at least the foreseeable. Ah. Uh, I say that and uh, he dies. Well, this just got interesting. Alright, we definitely can't have our main guy die. Losing Kalheed. Moments after I had just said. <laughs> oh, this is this is gonna be rough. Okay, so this isn't this isn't a game ender. We're gonna keep we're gonna keep going with this. Um, we will res Kalheed though. Um, we're just not gonna do it in this episode. Uh, what we'll probably end up doing is. I will. We're going to continue as far down as we can. And then I might, in between episodes, just because it'll save us viewing time, I will probably just res him and then bring us back to the location where we end time? on this episode. Um, yeah, let's not have the two mages. Yeah, there we go. So, our party is extreme squish right now. Which is not the end of the world. It just puts us in a. Yeah, there's no way we could fight the boss right now. Like, I absolutely need Kalki to be able to take some of that damage. Yep. I need MON to be attacking. Uh -huh. What is it this? Stand back!
there's another trap over here somewhere. This turns into a, an inching game. All right, let's pull back. I don't want to. I don't want to avoid trying to end games all at the same time. This way we can do that. My blade will cut you down the side. Perfect. Uh, flaming or uh, possibly frosty. Death. There might be an archer or a caster or something like that. Yeah, an archer. My blade will cut you down to Let's give them a right thrashing. Now I'm pretty sure there's a trap here. So much so that I'm willing to wager the care my main characters. You have but to ask. Uh anything? Yes. Okay. I know there's more traps down here. I bet it's right there. That'd be hilarious. How may I be? I shall attend to it in a trice. Mm -hmm. Oh, wait a minute. Ah, the lava bridge. Okay. Now there, yep, there's one of them. Disarm that and we'll pull him back and we'll lure, we'll kite these cobalts back to us. What is it this time? Oh, I can hear their pitta patter. Oh, are they not walking up? What's wrong? There's something most unnatural here, and I want no part of it. I know, me neither. But here we are. Yes? Let's see if I can get this trap to start before place. they hit me. Oh, why did it? There we go. Huh. How may I be of assistance? Okay, now I'm a little concerned. I don't know where they went. At the start of next episode, we will definitely start at the start of the lava bridge. That is the perfect point for next episode. But I definitely want to explore at least a little bit of what's left. My blade will cut you down to size. Oh my gosh. Uh, okay. There might not be a next episode. Oh my goodness. Uh, okay. How to do this. We're gonna actually have to, uh, yeah, we're gonna have to burn the oil with speed. Otherwise, they will get. I, yeah, I'm pretty sure they will get swarmed and overwhelmed. My blade will cut you down to size. Might have been overkill, but I'd rather be safe than sorry. I shall attend to it in the truck. Wow, it has been way too long since I have, uh, an open wound in Mother Earth. I would plug it had I the power. Let's see. I had just completely, completely blindsided by that. That was that was totally on me. Just walk around the corner and be like, "Yeah, we're fine, man." And all of a sudden, there's like a host of coal builds that are just like, "What's going on?" I heard you thought that you thought this was easy. <laughs> we're here to tell you otherwise. I think that I thought there was a way to cross here, but I guess not. I guess it's only the center bridge. Alright folks, well, we're going to wrap this episode up here. Um, I'm going to go res Khalid and bring us back to the, uh, the Lava Bridge. Um, this has been Cody with CRS Labs, and thank you for joining me, and we'll see you next episode.